There are many water jet cutting applications that can benefit from the use of hydroblock bricks. In this video, we will cover how to use hydroblock and share some tips that will extend the life of your bricks. To begin, create a bed by placing bricks on the table, laying them perpendicular, 90 degrees, to the slats. This creates a flat, even surface for cutting. The entire table can be covered with bricks or just a section. Next, clamp the bricks in place so they don't migrate during cutting. Clamping will also increase the life of hydroblock. Now that the table is ready, it's time to get your material ready for cutting. Screws or fasteners can be used to hold the material in place. This is helpful when cutting small or light items that may shift during cutting. The life of your hydroblocks will be affected by the material you are cutting, how quickly you are cutting, and if abrasive is used. We recommend flipping hydroblock when the surface is worn to extend the life and re-establish solid cutting surface. Raising the water level during cutting also increases brick life. In summary, here are three easy steps to follow as you prepare to cut on hydroblock. Place the bricks. Clamp the bricks. Fasten the material if necessary. The life of your hydroblocks will be extended by clamping the bricks tightly in place, raising the water level during cutting, flipping the bricks when the surface is worn. Questions? Call us at 800-741-7756 for more information about using your hydroblock water jet bricks.